Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you can't already tell by the title of this video, today's video is going to be a Primark haul. So about a week ago, we went shopping to Primark and every single year, literally without fail, my nan and granddad always take me and my brother and my cousin out on like a little shopping spree. And they buy us like a new summer wardrobe sort of thing. So yeah, we went shopping for that last week and I just got like a few things. Well, there's quite a lot of stuff here. I spent £87 in Primark, which is quite a lot, but I did get, you know, like decent stuff. It wasn't just a load of crap that I didn't need. I got decent stuff. But yeah, I thought I'd give you a little Primark try on haul because I literally love watching these and I love seeing what like new stuff is in Primark. And I'm pretty sure all of this is like brand new because when I went like two or three weeks ago, they didn't have any of this stuff in here and then like, last week they did. So I'm just gonna get straight into it and show you what I got. I just hate it when they give you hangers. Like I really don't want these and I'm not gonna use these but now it's like a waste of hangers. So I don't know what to do with them. Maybe I'll give them to my mum. But they always do it and I said no hangers. I literally said to her no hangers. Okay, so the first thing that I picked up was this like frilly crop top. It's really, really cute and I really liked it on the hanger and so I went and tried it on and it was it is really, really lovely. It's nice to wear like underneath dresses and things like that, but it is pretty see-through. So I can't really wear this as a plain top. I can only really wear it underneath a dress or, you know, that's it really. Or actually the other day I did wear it with some sort of top like this underneath, but if it's like really warm, you don't wanna wear a double top. Yeah, this is really nice. I do really like this. However, it is kind of fraying. I don't know whether you can see that. There. I've worn it twice maybe and it's fraying already so not the best quality but it was only four pounds and I got this in a size extra small <laughs> that I got that I'm gonna get out of the way are two packs of thongs these are literally my favorite ones ever so comfortable and they are two pound fifty for three pairs which is really good I think because they're quite good quality and I've got these already and they've lasted me for a long time I have probably had the ones that I have right now for about a year which is really really good um, yeah, so I just got a plain white pair and a plain black pair and I got these in a size small because they do like come up really small. You have to get them a little bit bigger because they are not true to size. And then I also got this strapless bra. It does come with straps. The straps are right here, but I've already worn it so I took them off. I have this bra already. I've probably had this for... This bra that I'm wearing right now, actually, I've had this for about five years, which is really gross, I know, but I could never find the same bra. And then I saw this and I was like, I'm getting that because it's literally the exact same bra. And it's the best strapless bra I've ever had. Like I've never found one that's as good as this. And this was, how long? This was seven pounds, which is a bargain for a bra that lasts you for five years. Like that's amazing. So yeah, I'm gonna chuck this away now because I don't need it anymore. Can I just say before I show you the next thing that my tan is absolutely awful and I know it. I know that there's a massive patch down here, but basically I started to use the Bondi Sands, what's it called? Bondi Sands Liquid Gold Tanner and it's like the foam one. Didn't realize that it was a gradual tan so I put like a ton on because it just had no color payoff. And then, yeah, turned out like this. So, gotta scrub this off tonight but just ignore that for now, I had to film this video. So this is the next thing that I brought. It's just like a little nighty, basically. It's really, really soft and I kind of wanted one of these to wear in the summer because I wear like big t-shirts and things and they're quite thick some of them so I thought that this would be really nice it's really thin and then I can just wear this like around the house a bit as well because it's quite long uh, this was five pounds and I got this in a size extra small which is a six to eight by the way <laughs> Primark right now there are a load of really cute like summery dresses and jumpsuits and things like that so that's pretty much all I got from Primark except from the stuff that I've already shown you so I'm gonna start with my least favorite one I've actually already worn this and you probably saw this if you watched my last video which was my 
vlog when I got my hair done. So this is the first cute dress. It's basically just checkered. Kind of looks white on the camera, but it's kind of like a beigey cream color. Um, this is really nice. I actually got this in a size six and I think this was 10 pounds. Where's my receipt? So this is actually 10 pounds and it's really nice quality. So it's definitely worth it. The only thing is, it's not really my sort of style. I don't really normally wear things like this. So kind of looks a bit schooly to me, but I wore this with a top underneath. I think on its own, it looks kind of weird, but each their own. If you want to get this and wear it on its own, then that's fine. But yeah, it's actually really nice material, surprisingly, for Primark. The only thing is you need to iron it before every time because otherwise you can't even see the crinkles on the camera, but otherwise it gets really, really crinkly. I only got this because I tried it on in the changing rooms and my mum and my cousin were both like, that's their favourite one. So I had to get this because they loved it so much. Uh, but I probably wouldn't have got it otherwise. It's still nice though, and it's still nice for some occasions, but not my favourite. <laughs> kind of the same it's the same dress but it's got a different pattern on it and I think it's kind of different material as well but I really like this one because even though it is quite girly and quite childish it is just really cute and I thought for the summer I would happily wear this or if I went on holiday or something and this looks nice on its own or with a t-shirt underneath this was 10 pounds as well and I think I got this in a size six yes yeah, so 10 pounds size six really good bargain i think and i just love it like it's not really my kind of style necessarily i kind of want to venture out on my style this year because i always just stick to the same sort of clothes jeans and a crop top or jeans and a top or something like that and i love wearing dresses but i just don't really look right in them to me i don't think i look right in them so yeah getting more dresses <laughs> is this jumpsuit I can't really hold it up to show you but it's just like this kind of material it's really flowy and actually looks quite nice on and yeah this pattern is quite quirky I would never normally wear this again but when I tried it on my mum absolutely fell in love and actually wanted it for herself but apparently it didn't look right on her so she made me get it instead but it's basically got like a little string to tie at the front and yeah, it's really, really flowy. So if you feel like covering up all of your lumps and bumps, this is definitely the one. However, it is quite out there with the pattern, but for holiday or for, you know, like a summer's day, it would be really nice. So I got this in a size eight and it was 15 pounds, which is quite a lot to be honest. And that's probably why I didn't want to get it, but my mum made me. But yeah, for Primark, that's quite a lot for an outfit. <laughs> was this dress I thought this was so cute it's like a long dress and it's got a slit in the leg I thought that this was just so lovely it looks really really lovely on and you can wear it with a top underneath or just on its own and yeah I absolutely loved the pattern and the color um, it's really nice material as well it's quite thick normally Primark clothes are really thin but this is quite thick same with the pinafore sort of dresses. I got this in a size six because they didn't have any size eights, but I probably would have preferred to get this in a size eight. I just loved it so much that I needed to get it in a size six. It is therefore probably a little bit tight for me and it's probably intended to be a little bit more flowy, but I don't really care. It's a lovely dress, so. Yeah, so this is actually a midi slip dress. That's what it's called. And this was 13 pounds, which I thought was a bargain for a dress like this like it's so nice and you could probably get this in like Topshop or Urban Outfitters and it would be 10 times the price so that's that one <laughs> 
was another dress shock um definitely a summer haul isn't it so this is the next dress this is so nice honestly i love pink this is kind of like a peachy color to be honest peachy corally color but it's just so lovely and it's really nice on the neckline however is not my favorite it's kind of like too square for me i would have preferred it to be over the shoulders or slightly more open than this but the way that it sits is really lovely the way it like kind of flicks out at the bottom i love that so yeah and i got this in a size eight and this was 10 pounds i believe yes this was 10 pounds which is really really good again it's really good quality i think primark has definitely up their game with their quality of their clothes because all of these clothes are pretty nice except from this one this one's a little bit more thinner than the others but i think it's the style of the jumpsuit so it doesn't really matter to me <laughs> left and that is this really cute little dress it is the same pattern as the blue one that i showed you the navy blue one but this one is obviously a mustard yellow or i don't is that a mustard yeah i think that's mustard yellow basically this is probably one of my favorites either this or the pink dress uh, it's just so nice. It sits really nicely on me You can wear this with a little top underneath again like some of the other clothes or you can just wear it on its own It just looks so lovely and I love the way that it just like Flicks out at the ends and yeah, it's really really soft material. It's a different material to this dress this dress is kind of more of a rough material whereas this is like soft I don't know whether you would be able to no you can't see that but they are the same pattern which is weird do you think it's like a printed pattern maybe it's printed i got this in a size eight i actually wanted this in a size six because it would have sat better on my boobs but that's fine it again it's really nice so i had to get it um this was 10 pounds which i just thought was like incredible for this really cute little dress like it's just so lovely and I definitely will be wearing this all the time and you will see this in my videos all the time. You can wear this over a long sleeve top if it's a little bit colder or short sleeved if it's warmer or if it's boiling hot then just wear it on its own. it for my Primark haul. I didn't really get a lot as I said before. Some people get like a ton of clothes from Primark and do a massive Primark haul but this is just like a small haul to show you what's in Primark right now and what things are my favourite that I got from there. Let me know in the comments down below if you actually like this video. I hope that you do because it's something different to what I normally do. It's a bit more fashion related and normally my channel is health and fitness. I get a lot of people actually telling me that they like my videos on Instagram so if you prefer that then that's great, thank you. Yeah, I would definitely do some more of these videos if you enjoyed this. However, I don't really wanna be buying a ton of clothes because I just got rid of a load. So maybe like an autumn one or like a winter one. Anyway, I post videos every Thursday and Sunday. I'm actually changing my day from Wednesday to Thursday because I work Monday to Wednesday, so it makes it a lot harder for me to actually get out a video on the Wednesday, as you can probably tell because I have been slacking with the Wednesday upload. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Ooh.
boom, 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 boom.